world without the saxophone would be a world without an infinite variety of joy. I'm Paul Cohen. In addition to being a professional saxophonist, I have the largest private collection of saxophones in the world, including some of the rarest instruments ever made. I got my first saxophone when I was bar mitzvah in eighth grade. Right now I have about 200 instruments in my collection, some of them are novelties. One of my personal favorite saxophones is this small curved sopranino. This one was made by the King Company in Cleveland around 1930. They produced only one of these instruments. This is the one. My real driving force to collect these instruments was an insatiable curiosity about an instrument that I played. As I was able to actually put my hands on these instruments and explore them and to play them, it got me even more interested to see what other kinds of varieties were out there and why they were made and how they were used. Another very special instrument in my collection, one that is very endearing to me, is the amazing Conosax. It was so innovative, so radical, and so impractical that they sold almost none of them in 1928. We know now of maybe 25 in the world. There really is no other instrument that transcends music like the saxophone. It's a great jazz instrument. It's a beautiful classical instrument. It's used in rock and roll. It's used in new age music. It fits all these musical genres well because of the inherent flexibility of sound. So I can find my voice, my personal voice on the instrument, and then as an expressive tool for that, I feel I can make a very direct connection to all who are listening. <laughs>